hey y'all welcome back to my channel so hurricane barrel is headed for the texas coast between matagorda bay out here between bay city and lake jackson it's heading straight up into the houston area right now it's approximately about 40 miles from the coast the eye is and they're saying now about three two in the morning it's going to be um inland so let's see what it says right here. yeah around about three and they say after that all the rain chances are going to go up um right now the outer bands are coming in and they're in the coastal communities more towards palacious port lavaca galveston lake jackson area bay, bay city and um also the southwest side of houston is really going to be in that track and i'm seeing that sugarland and west houston have high rain chances it's going to be a lot of rainfall in that area the whole houston area is going to get a lot of rain but uh, those areas are going to have high concentrations of rain all the way up to lufkin and uh projected rain is from anywhere from four to eight in some areas ten to 15 possible inches of rain so right now my area is not raining we got rain earlier it was a pretty good downpour for about 45 minutes and then it all just you know went out it was a um a band around about i think it was around like one or two o'clock but anyway um we're just on storm watch um i may sit up to see the 2 a.m broadcast it's going to be a 2 a.m broadcast between two and four uh for the weather and uh we'll just see how this rain goes they shut down the city for monday and tuesday so they're seeing no school and the city officials won't be working and public transportation is all canceled and everything and they're advising everybody to stay home so we're just going to see how this pans out right now the storm is moving north and then it's going to move north um east a little bit and then go on to the northeast up into let's see uh, the tip of Louisiana around Shreveport, um, Arkansas, and straight on up. Let's see how far up. Indiana. So let's zoom in. Yeah. It's going to cross several states. Tennessee, Missouri, and dissipate. But Barrel has been around for a while. Barrel has been around for literally like almost two weeks now. And uh, this is the end of Barrel. It ends in Texas. So you guys stay safe if you're on the um, coast of Texas in between anywhere between Victoria and all the way to East Texas. Um, just stay on weather watch. People in Columbus and Victoria really don't have anything to worry about besides wind. But everything to the east of this storm is going to get some rain. So they're saying that Houston really is going to get a lot of this rain. Uh, Houston was projected to not get very much when it was further south towards uh, Corpus coming onto land. But now that Houston is right in the bullseye, basically, they're saying that Houston is going to have a lot of heavy flooding. So you guys stay safe out there. Peace.